On the 14th day of Christmas, my true love gave to me. You're gonna have to open up the present to find out. I'm Sandy. I'm John. And this is my Lady Disdain. I did not expect this at all. <laughs> So we've got one more surprise for Sandy uh, that I've been waiting a while for. It has been stuck in transport hell uh, for the past like few months and it is finally here. I have so much to say about this, but I can't because- More Christmas. She needs to just open it. Yay, more Christmas. The trapping paper looks really pretty on camera. Yeah, it reflects the nice lightly. The nice lightly, yes. <laughs> That's what he said. I'm not even going to read it. I'm just going to open it. <laughs> I'm not reading. Okay, so you're going to completely ignore the... All right, we'll come back to it, I guess. This way? Yep. Okay. I believe Customs has already opened it. I contacted an Etsy uh, artist. The shop is the Menagerie Art Dolls. The artist is Elena Sapojnikova. Yeah, it really is, Benny. And I had her create a custom art doll or toy um, based on uh, Sandy's forever dog, Benny. And it is so... Very much Benny. It really, I thought I was just thinking the little suit and I was like, it's Benny. It's a Boston Terrier, yeah. it's Benny. No, it's, no, it's, it's really Benny. literally Benny. I guess you can probably tell how much I loved that dog. We loved him. He was my he special was boy. Everyone who knew this dog loved him. It really does look like him. Yep, she even, I mean, she got his toes. His little feet. I love it, honey. <laughs> I, I've shared this, like, you know, with so many people, because, like, I couldn't stay quiet about it. Um... <laughs> I've had pictures of him for a while. I was just like, they're like, you're gonna win Christmas. I'm like, no, I'm going to destroy Sandy. <laughs> he's beautiful. So I, I believe he's, a, he's a, a, a clay head. So hand sculpted. Uh, she had uh, a run of other custom dolls that she had done, which were um, a French bulldog, pug. Like, I was like, can you do a Boston? And I sent her a picture and she was like, I want to do this. Uh, I'm just looking at him from this angle in the camera and I'm like, oh my God, it's him. Yeah. Like, <laughs> he's beautiful. Is he like, I wonder if he's like fully finished? No, or he just his is, legs? He's, a, he's a stuffed animal. So he has, he has clay arms, but the arms, the arms and legs are poseable. So they, they basically have like that, that, like rotation i don't remember what he, the hinge is called but the, yeah, it rotates it rotates but it says he, yeah it just doesn't he doesn't have like knee joints or anything correct like that. that's so, okay because benny didn't have very good knees anyway <laughs> he's beautiful <laughs> and look at his little suit it's perfect yeah this handmade little gentleman suit i probably have my do i have mascara running down my face well i don't know if you well if you, you do now if you didn't before <laughs> as you like smear it <laughs> That's fine. He's beautiful. Let's just make sure everyone can see him. I got the little, like, the eyelets as little buttons. Uh, 
These little guys, he's got a full shirt. I just keep looking, my god, he's so beautiful. I will say this, I sent her a really close up shot of Pang's face uh -huh. so that she could really get an understanding of how that sort of black olive sort of look that the eyes have. So she used Pang's eyes. I mean, I reference. think they're pretty, yeah, as, uh, but you know. they're pretty close. Like, I'm looking at him and I'm like. <laughs> oh, that squareness that, that yeah. like, especially this eye has. That's my boy. Yep. His maple syrup head. <laughs> yep. I think she just put brown in there or whatever. But what's funny is when he was little, some spaghetti sauce fell on his head. And it never quite left his white spot. No matter what I did, I scrubbed it and scrubbed <laughs> it, and and it never went away. And it looked—it almost looks like he's got a little spaghetti spot it right does. there. I don't, I don't think she, because a lot of the shots that I shared were like black and white shots and stuff like that. No, it's actually like it's a blushing the, kind of thing that it, she did. Yeah, you can see the uh, it. It's the shadowing into that sort of crease in his forehead. He's beautiful. I did not expect this at all. <laughs> I I got Benny when I was 30, and we lost him to heart failure when he was 12. I had him from like six weeks, and uh, he was my heart. God, it still is. Yeah. And, uh, oh, this is beautiful. You know, I have him to put with his footprints and everything I can put the doll with his footprints and stuff not nah, i mean you can or he can work with you and stuff i mean you know whatever you want You're like i don't i don't think you'll probably want to but one route you could take is this could be you know you could put some ashes inside of him and have like sort of a you know a doll urn i don't know if anybody does that but um, i think they do i suppose um, i could do that but I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to touch it. <laughs> I'm so impressed with all of the coloration, like, it's, <laughs> it's him. His grandma's got to see this. I, I know. Did you tell her she's, about it? She's seen a picture. Oh, she, she saw a picture when I first got, when... When he was first done. Oh, you know what? Christmas that is... Day, she was saying to me, call me when you open your presents. I was like, I was like, mom, you need, like, it's not getting open today. It's not here yet. Chill. <laughs> she was so anxious to talk to you after that. She was um, very close to him, too, because I lived with her when I got him. Yep. So she was very, very close to Benny. This is beautiful, honey. <laughs> So now I have a clay doll. Yeah, it's it's a, it's an art toy. That's what she describes it as. I mean, it, it's a stuff. It's a it's a stuffed animal. That's what's her name? Yeah, it's it's Elena Sapozhnikova. Well, Elena, if you see this video, you got it. He's beautiful. Now's the point. Typically, when I when I buy Sandy something, I will then tell her what I almost bought her, <laughs> which is how we got into smart dolls. Um, but Elena has an actual doll, um, which is, I think the, it's, it's what's on her, uh, like her profile picture. It's this rabbit doll. Imagine a rabbit head in, in like clay and everything, but a fully posable doll, like in Victorian dress. And I was like, that is so Sandy. That is the most Sandy thing I've ever seen in my life. And then I saw the pug, this little squat, little pug in a, a little tuxedo kind of, you know, thing. <laughs> And I was like, and then, and I was like, oh, it's custom. Okay, this is happening. I'm like this, I'm like this has to happen. I have to see if they can make Benny, and and she did, and it's, it is the best. All the little details on his mouth and and his little fur bits, like all, all the gray over his eyebrows, and yeah, I want to say this is probably at about like ten ish or something. Yeah, he's got some gray coming in around his face. But the, I mean, the craftsmanship, like this is fantastic. His little nose. Yeah. I love that his ears are fur, so you can pet them. Yep. I mean, I love that they're, they're actually like wired so you can, I mean, Benny would always have pretty straight ears. But. Yeah. Once in a while, one would droop a little, but he had pretty straight ears. And you know, what's really interesting is he probably wasn't much bigger than this when I got him. <laughs> So this is your Benjamin Button, <laughs> it's literally Mrs. Benedict Button. Eh. <laughs> yeah. 
his head fit in a little plastic cup. We had to stop at um at like McDonald's to get him some water on the yep. way home because it was really hot. And it was one of those little cups they give you when you ask for water. One of those little like almost like a Dixie cup. Yeah. And his whole head fit inside the cup. That's how small he was. Well, we're gonna give Sandy some some time uh, alone with Benny and uh, probably some time to you know FaceTime with her mom and uh, and let her know that she got him and. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I, I, I can't say enough good things uh, uh, about uh, Elena. Um, again, the Etsy store is the Menagerie Art Dolls. And, you know, she's got a couple of really interesting things here. But she was so fantastic to work with um, and, and just really gracious and, and made such an amazing, uh, beautiful uh, art toy. So if you enjoyed uh, this rather emotional unboxing, um, uh, you should also check out uh, the cat I got Sandy for Christmas this year. Our first resin BJD, Vivian L. or Le Festin from Dear Mind Dolls. Click there to watch it, and we will see you soon. Bye, everybody. Bye. Oh, wow, you broke me.